Hello and welcome back to a new segment of Immigration Talks. My name is Lizelle Lontajo, one of the visa advisors at Enhanced Visa. And I'm here to give you the latest update on Canadian immigration. There had been a lot of updates lately with the resumption of express entry draw, the extension of PGWPs, and the introduction of new TR to PR program. But before we get into the nitty gritty detail, please like this video and subscribe to our channel. It will really help us a lot. Done? Now, let's talk immigration. The Canadian labor market is critically dependent on the high levels of immigration, according to a new study. The study, conducted by Statistics Canada, found modest, sustained levels of immigration will not be sufficient to offset the long-term labor impact of Canada's aging population. As Canada's post-pandemic economic continue to grow, employers are experiencing significant labor shortages. According to Statistics Canada, nearly 40% of the businesses anticipated worker shortages in early 2022. According to Statistics Canada's latest job vacancy report, the number of job openings across the country reached an all-time high of 957,500. This was an increase of 2.7% from the previous peak in the last quarter and over 80% above pre-pandemic levels. This was the highest quarterly number on record. The latest figure also showed that job vacancies continue to rise in the healthcare and social assistance sector. The number of vacancies in this sector increased by 5% from the previous quarter. The healthcare and social assistance sector is growing rapidly due to the aging population. Shortage was further exasperated by the COVID-19 pandemic. Job vacancies have also continued to rise to a high record in the construction sector. Construction sector vacancies were up by 7.1% from the previous quarter, with 81,500 positions to fill. Manufacturing and retail trade sectors also reached record high vacancies, peaking at 87,400 in the manufacturing sector and 114,600 in the retail trade sector. As Canada faces an acute shortage of skilled workers, many businesses have struggled to find the right people to fill positions. To help address this problem, Canada has turned immigration to fill record numbers of job openings. Canada's immigration minister announced new measures to help ensure Canada can recruit and retain workers needed to keep the economy going. Among the measures included, extending post-graduation work permits and resuming all program express entry draws. The government previously increased immigration targets in February 2022. Canada may need to continue to increase immigration levels to keep up with demand. Labor market outcomes for immigrants improved substantially in the years leading up to the pandemic. According to Statistics Canada, the employment rate of recent immigrants has increased by 8 percentage points since early 2010s while the earnings among recent economic immigrants rose by 39%. In contrast, the employment rate for Canadian-born workers increased by just 2% for the same period. The study's authors say that improvements are likely due to a number of factors, including stronger economic growth in Canada and changes to immigration policy. Report found that the increased reliance on temporary foreign workers or TFW tends to improve the economic outcomes of immigrants. Programs like the Canadian Experience Class or CEC and Provincial Nominee Program or PNPs typically invites candidates that are already working in Canada and therefore more likely to succeed in the labor market. As the economy continues to grow, there are not enough Canadians to fill the available jobs. Immigrants are vital to fill the gap and help to keep the economy strong. This is why immigration will remain to be crucial to Canada in the following years. If you are interested in immigrating to Canada, consult with us today. Enhanced Visa has been changing people's lives through immigration for the past 27 years. To get in touch, here are my contact details. I hope you got value from our content today. If you did, please do like this video or leave us a comment below to show some love. Thank you so much for staying with me until the end of the video. Until our next one, bye!